Alright, yo, what's up guys? Kov here today, and today I am going to be showing you how to install Pixelmon 1.16.5 onto your Minecraft. And basically, Pixelmon's pretty cool. Um, I haven't really played a lot of it, but you get to play with Pix... I mean, not Pixelmons, but Pokemons in Minecraft, which... It's kind of cool. Um, it's one of those mods that, like... It's, it's just over the top. It's not like anything else I've ever really seen before done. So anyways guys, I'm going to be showing you how to install it because it can be kind of confusing to install, but there's basically four main steps. First off, we're going to launch vanilla 1.16.5 on its own first, and then basically we're going to download Java, and then we're going to download Reforged um, Pixelmon, which is pretty much the mod, and then we're going to install Forge, which is what allows you to run. And basically the third step, I mean the fourth step after that, is basically play and enjoy so anyways guys i'm going to be using windows 10 on my macbook so it's not going to be the best performance but for you guys i know some of you guys got insane computers out there so it's probably going to run really good for you but anyways guys first off what i want you to do click on the minecraft launcher and uh yeah so basically once you're at this launcher here wait for it to load i'm sure you guys are very familiar and basically right here click installations and then you might have a lot of installations here you might not but basically just click new installation and then just name it 1.16.5 and go down here and then type in 1.16 and then basically you just want to find release 1.16.5 great now click create and then click play now guys what we're doing is we're launching it so the reason why we're doing that is because if we need to when we need to install minecraft forge um nothing really goes wrong because what will happen is if you don't launch 1.16.5 then forge isn't going to know what to install forge on like what version so yeah um i hope that really helps you out and clarifies it i'm going to time lapse through this part but um we'll be right back <laughs> Alright guys, now Minecraft 1.16.5 is loading up, and once that happens, we basically can, um, you know, close the game. So yeah, let's wait for that to happen, um, it's loading, so yeah, I'm going to time lapse a little bit more. Alright guys, so once you're on this page here, just click quit game. That's right guys, you're already done with step one. So yeah that was it that's step one now second step go to the link in the description and click on the java link and yeah now you might already be saying i don't know what java is or some of you might be saying i already have java installed i don't need to do this well i recommend everyone even if you have java installed i recommend re-downloading java um basically what this will do is it'll update your java to the latest release and that doesn't really hurt anything unless you have a specific program that requires a specific version of Java. If you don't even know what Java is, just install it anyways. We're going to be looking for the Windows Offline 64-bit, or if you're on Mac OS, do this one right here. Um, yeah, make sure you do 64-bit. Most computers nowadays are 64-bit. If you know you have a 32-bit, you can download the second one. But um, yeah, so now you can open it. If you don't know where that is, or you're not using Chrome, just go to your downloads, it'll be there. But um, basically, just click yes to everything that you see. Um, you'll wait for it to load up, essentially. Um, it doesn't take that long. So, yeah, it's just going to take a minute. So, yeah. All right, so now you'll be brought up to this page here. It'll say, um, for me, it's going to say remove because I already have Java. And if you already have Java installed, it'll say remove. For some of you, it might just say install. Whatever you do, even if it, even if you have installed, just click or un. If you already have Java installed, just make sure you click install anyways. It doesn't take that long, and it's going to update to the latest version, because otherwise Pixelmon isn't going to work. So I'm going to time lapse through this until it's done. Alright guys, so once it's installed, it'll say you've successfully installed Java. Congratulations, now click close. Now, you guys are done with step two. That's right, only two more steps to go. It's that simple. So now you want to go back to the link in the description and we're going to actually install the Pixelmon mod. So Pixelmon, it'll be a reforge.gg link and we're going to be installing two things on this page. So first off, since we're downloading 1.16.5, I'm going to click on the big green download 1.16.5. 
I know it looks kind of like a virus, but it's not that button. Now, do not click on anything on this page. Don't click on Minecraft Reforge server hosting or any of this crap. It can give you a virus. Just click the big red skip button. Um, I'm not going to be responsible if you click on something and you get a virus or whatever. All right, now you'll see this starts downloading in the whatever, your Chrome thing. Now, under the 1.16.5, you want to download the Forge release. So this right here, just click on that. Make sure you download 1.16.5 Forge. And again, don't click anything on the page. You will, you probably will screw up your computer if you do that. Um, this is how this Pixelmon is free is because, you know, you have to put sketchy ads like that. But just be super careful. And I'm not responsible if you do that. Now, like I said, um, you can just minimize that or whatever, and I'll minimize this, and basically go down to your downloads, like so, and as you'll see, you'll have probably a lot more than I do. Now, this is the JRE or the Java down installer. Just get rid of that. You don't need it. Um, once you're on this page, though, you see you want to click on this Forge one. You just want to double click on it. Um, basically, we're going to be installing Minecraft Forge. So yeah, so you'll be brought up to this page, and it'll say 1.16.5 Forge. If you've already installed Forge for any other version, it's pretty much simple, but just make sure you just click on Install Client and then click OK. And yeah, it goes pretty simple and it goes pretty fast. Um, I'm going to time lapse through this part, but again, it should be pretty quick. All right, guys, now once it's installed, it's going to say um, Congratulations, successfully installed or whatever. Just click OK. Now, from here on out, now you just want to go to the start menu and you want to type in percent app data like so and you want to do percent app data percent i'll leave this also in the link you can just copy this um this thing and paste it in to your um start menu but anyways there should be a folder that pops up you want to click dot minecraft you should have a dot minecraft folder here if you have minecraft installed so yeah and then basically once you're here you want to put this so basically once you're here you want to go into your pixelmon Right click on that and click cut. Now make sure, don't do it for the Forge, do it for the Pixelmon 1.16.5. Um, I know it's kind of confusing, but yeah. Now, once you're here onto your um, dot .minecraft folder here, you want to look for a mods folder. Now, some of you are going to have a mods folder here, some of you aren't, but you're going to need one. So, I don't have a mods folder here. If I click M, no mods folder shows up. So, just right click over here, click new, click folder, and then just name it mods like that. Now, make sure it's all under case and everything, lowercase, and click enter. And basically, if you already have one, great. If you don't, just make one like I did. And then, you know, paste your um, Pixelmon mod in there. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much the third step done, guys. Now, the last thing we have to do, open up Minecraft Launcher. And, uh, yeah, so we're almost there, essentially. We just got to make sure that we load the right version. So, what you'll find is that if you've just installed um, Forge here, basically what you'll find is it already says forge and basically you can just use this one but if for some reason this forge doesn't show up or it something just happens what you can do is you can click on new installation and then just type in one one point sixteen point five and then you can just do pixel mon or whatever whatever you want to call it and then just make sure on the release section you type in one point sixteen point five and then you do forge make sure it's the forge release you should have a forge release and then while you're on this section you want to make sure you click on more options now down here you're going to see something called jvm arguments like i have here and basically you see how this says two gigs of ram or x xmx 2g well that's not going to be enough ram to run pixelmon unfortunately now you might be wondering okay so that's not enough ram how much ram should i give pixelmon and basically it's pretty simple you just want to go to your start and you want to type in task manager like so and basically go down to performance and you see i have eight gigabytes of memory i recommend giving pixelmon half of your computer's memory so eight divided by two is four so i'm just going to give it four like so and i'm just going to click create and also i don't know why i accidentally named it 1.15.5 but just get rid of that original 1.16.5 version we don't really need it anymore and anyways with that now also make sure that you do the um if you're going to use this regular forge one make sure under here you make the jvm argument also four or whatever now it, if you have a computer with 16 gigs of ram make sure you give it eight or whatever just give it half of your computer's memory but anyways i'm just going to prove that if you don't have this for some reason 
just click 1.6.5 all right and then just you can make one it doesn't matter you can use the forge one I just like to make my own because you know why not and also you can close out of that if you don't use it and congratulations now you pretty much have Pixelmon installed um, as you can see this is gonna take quite a while the first time you load this so what I recommend doing is just going making dinner or eating or something and this will be back by the time you're there um, I'm going to pretty much time lapse through all this because it pretty much takes forever and yeah because it's the first time loading and it's a lot of data to load so basically guys I'll be back when this is done all right guys so pretty much it's loaded up guys so pretty much as you guys can see um, Pixelmon is loaded so yeah so basically once you're here you can just click multiplayer and you have all these servers so yeah so I'm just gonna click on complex US and I'm just gonna click join server um, yeah you can join whatever you want you want it just has to be 1.16.5 compatible um, for me it's going to take a bit to load because like I said running this on a MacBook so yeah um, once I load in and I prove to you that Pixelmon has fully installed then I'm just going to end off the video here um, but yeah I'm just gonna let this load alright guys so as you can see here Pixelmon has loaded for me I've already played the server once so um, yeah but it's here so anyways guys for me like I said playing on a MacBook it's gonna be super super laggy and not very fun but if you're playing this on a really good computer you're not gonna have these issues I'm having but anyways guys thank you for watching um, if you want to like and even maybe subscribe if I helped you out that'd be great if you don't want to though that's completely fine um, pretty much guys enjoy Pixelmon it's a very fun mod and uh, anyways guys bye